Hi people, I hope you are doing great. So today I am going to take you through a small request which I have received and I, do, I, I don't think that is useful as of now but I just thought of posting it. So uh, someone has requested that whenever he is opening the Excel file, he wants some user form or a, or a message box should appear, do blah 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 or something like that. So that is possible two ways, either you can have message box or you can design a user form. So message box is like um, you have some certain limitations in that you can have OK, try, cancel or like that. But in a user form, you can completely customize it. So it depends on your requirement. No doubt user, user form will take some space and message box is faster, no doubt. So there is like point milli, milli, milli seconds of uh, difference in the speed which you cannot make out at all. So but what I believe the shorter the code the better so I would prefer using a message box but if it is a requirement that you have to show um, customized uh, message box where you can choose from some buttons some customized buttons so, so then I can show you the code as well how this is going, going to work right now I do not uh, take you through uh, line by line I do not show you the code line by line because but I believe that nowadays people are too busy in their work. They just want the end product. They don't want to get into the each line. But I am soon going to start some training sessions as well, where I will be taking you through from the scratch how the thing starts, how the, how the the code starts from beginning. And I hope you would like it. So here is my Excel file, and I will hit the Alt F11. So whenever we want to run anything on the sheet open event so we go to this workbook and we choose workbook and then in the second drop down we choose open so it means that whenever a workbook is opening then do this so first first thing first we want to do is like to display a message box that is the first option so I would just uh, define uh, a as integer and then a equal to msg box you can always google the syntax do do you want to continue question mark vb yes or no and then we can add vb uh, information and then the, this IntelliSense will give you everything. Now I am writing title. If you look here, this is IntelliSense. Title is, are you sure? And then we close here. If if A equal to V B yes, then message box user has said yes. Else user has said msg box no so coming back to my code so i'll just hit f5 to run this one and there is an error wow there is end if missing that is not expected from me okay let's try my luck again okay so whenever you will close this file and you open this file you will get this option are you sure and you can customize anything you want and one thing you have to ensure that whenever you are we are saving this file then you have to save it is xlsm which stands for micro enabled workbook so do not just save it in this format save it in enabled run code on open all right so next option is whenever um, right now i'm getting like yes no or maybe i can change it to okay cancel there are many options but in case you want a customized dialog box so in that case what you have to do is uh, <coughs> you can add a user form user form is like a form which uh, you can add to this and I'll show you that how this works and I'm sure that most of you guys know about it so let's give a meaningful name to this dialogue a name hey 
and then I have to get the toolbox if you don't get the toolbox then go to view and here is toolbox okay so let's put two buttons over here control C control V and his its name is Aman and his Ajay okay so I think you got the idea so whenever I uh, run this one I hit F5 I can choose like this so on the click event if you want to do something just double click on this and you can have a click event I would suggest to give a meaningful name to the button over here here and here as well and to run this user form when you open the file what you need to do is you have to just use um, dialog dot show and I do exit sub so that I do not get the other message box and I hit F5 so this works so let's close this file and see how, if this really works and uh, this one let's open this and see how this works perfect so this user forms come whenever we open the file I hope this makes sense and this will uh, really help help you guys and if you have any questions do let me know in comments thank you for watching and have a nice day bye bye